Tam o Shantar by Robert Burns. This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information, please visit LibriVox.org. This reading by Gordon Mackenzie. Tam o Shantar by Robert Burns. A Tale. When Chapman Billy's leave the street, and drew the neighbours neighbours meet as market days are weir and late and folk begin to tack the gate while we sit boozin at the nappy and gettin few and unca happy we think na on the lang scots miles the mosses water slaps and styles that lie between us and our hame war sits our sulk sullen dame gathering her brows like gathering storm nursing her wrath to keep it warm this truth found honest tam o shanter as he frae air a night did canter old air wom ne'er a tune surpasses for honest men and bonny lasses o tam Hadst thou but been sae wise as tain thy ain wife Kate's advice, she told thee weel thou was a skellum, a blethering, blustering, drunken blellum, that frae November till October, a market day thou was nae sober, that ilka melder wit the miller, thou sat as lang as thou had siller that every nag was cad a shoe on the smith and thee got roar and few on that at the lord's house even on sunday thou drank wi curtain and jean till monday she prophesied that late or soon thou would be found deep drowned in dune or catched with warlocks in the murk by alloway's old hunted kirk Ah, gentle dames, it gars me greet to think how many counsels sweet, how many lengthened sage advices the husband frae the wife despises. But to our tale, a market night, Tam had got planted uncurite, fast by an ingle bleezing finely with reaming swats it drank divinely and at his elbow suitor johnny his ancient trusty drew the crony tam load him like a very brither they had been foo for weeks together the night drave on with sangs and clatter and i the ale was growing better the landlady and tam grew gracious with favours secret sweet and precious the suitor told his queerest stories the landlord's laugh was ready chorus the storm without might rare and wristle tam didna mind the storm a whistle care mad to see a man say happy e'en drowned himself among the nappy as bees flee hame wi lades o treasure the minutes wing their way with pleasure kings may be blessed but tam was glorious o'er aw the ills of life victorious but pleasures are like poppies spread you seize the flower its bloom is shed or like the snow falls in the river a moment white then melt for ever or like the borealis race that flit ere you can point their place or like the rainbow's lovely form evanishing amid the storm nay man can tether time or tide the hour approaches tom mun ride that hour o night's black arch the key stain that dreary hour he mounts his beast in and sick a night he tacks the road in as ne'er poor sinner was abroad in 
the wind blew as twad blown its last the rattlin showers rose on the blast the speedy gleams the darkness swallowed loud deep and lang the thunder bellowed that night a child might understand the deal had business on his hand wheel mounted on his grey mare meg a better never lifted leg tam skelp it on through dub and mire despising wind and rain and fire whiles holding fast his good blue bonnet whiles crooning o'er some old scots sonnet whiles glowering round with prudent cares lest boggles catch him unawares kirk alloway was drawing nigh where ghosts and owlets nightly cry by this time he was cross the ford war in the snaw the chapman smoored and past the burks in micklestain where drunken charlie brack's neck bane and through the winds and by the cairn where hunters fanned the murdered bairn and near the thorn aboon the well where mungo's mither hanged her cell before him doon pours all his floods the doubling storm roars through the woods the lightnings flash from pole to pole near and more near the thunders roll when glimmering through the groaning trees kirk alloway seemed in a bleeze through ilka bore the beams were glancing and loud resounding mirth and dancing inspiring bold john barleycorn what dangers thou canst make us scorn with tippany we fear nae evil we uskabe will face the devil the swat say reamed in tammy's noddle fair play he cared na deals a bottle but maggie stood right sair astonished till by the heel and hand admonished she ventured forward on the light and vow tam saw an unca sight warlocks and witches in a dance nae cotillion brent new frae france but hornpipes jigs strathspeys and reels put life and metal in their heels a winnick bunker in the east there sat old nick in shape o beast a towsy tyke black grim and large to give the music was his charge he screwed the pipes and got them skirl till roof and rafters ah did dirl coffins stood round like open presses that shod the dead in their last dresses and by some devilish cantrip slight each in its cold hand held a light by which heroic tam was able to note upon the halley table a murderer's banes in gibbet irons twa span lang we unchristened bairns a thief new gutted frae a rape wi his last gasp his gab did gape five tomahawks with blood red rusted five scimitars wi murder crusted a garter which a babe had strangled a knife a father's throat had mangled whom his ain son o life bereft the grey hairs yet stack to the heft wit mere o oh, horrible and awful which e'en to name would be unlawful as tam glowered amazed and curious the mirth and fun grew fast and furious 
the piper loud and louder blew, the dancers quick and quicker flew. They reeled, they set, they crossed, they click it, till Ilka Carlin swat and reek it, and coost her duddies to the work, and link it at it in her sark. Now, Tam, oh, Tam, had they been queens a plump and strappin' in their teens, their sarks instead o' creasy flannin' been snow-white seventeen hunder linen. Their breeks o' mine, my only pair, that ain'ts were plush o' good blue hair, I would hae gin them off my herdies for a blink o' the bonny birdies. But withered beldams, old and droll, Rig woody hags would spin a foal, Loupin' and flingin' on a crummock, A wonder didna turn thy stomach. But Tom kenned what was foe brawly, There was a winsome wench and wally, That night enlisted in the core, Lang after kenned on Carrick shore, For money a beast to dead she shot, and perished money a bonny boat, and shook baith mickle corn and bear, and kept the country side in fear. Her cutty sark, o paisley hairn, that while a lassie she had worn, in longitude though sorely scanty, it was her best, and she was vaunty. Ah, little ken thy reverend granny, that sark, she coughed for her wee nanny, with twa pawn Scots, twas all her riches, would ever graced a dance of witches. But here my muse, her wing mon cour, sick flights are far beyond her power, to sing how nanny lap and flang, a supple jade she was, and strang, and how Tam stood like ain bewitched, and thought his very een enriched, even Satan glowered, and fidged fu fain, and hotched and blew with might and main, till first a caper, sin a nither, Tam tint his reason ah together, and roars out, Weel done, cutty sark! And in an instant, all, oh, was dark, and scarcely had he, Maggie, rallied, when out the hellish legion sallied, as bees biz out wi' angry fike, when plundering herds assail their pike, as open pussies mortals foes, when pop she starts before their nose, as eager runs the market crowd, when catch the thief resounds aloud, so Maggie runs. The witches follow with money an eldrick screech and hollow. Ah, Tam, ah, Tam, thou'll get thy fairin. In hell they'll roast thee like a herin. In vain thy Kate awaits thy comin. Kate soon will be a woeful woman. Now do thy speedy utmost, Meg. And win the key stain, o oh, the brig, there at them thou thy tail may toss, a running stream they dare na cross. But ere the key stain she could make, the faint a tail she had to shake, for Nanny, far before the rest, hard upon noble Maggie pressed, and flew at Tam with furious ettle. But little wist she Maggie's metal, I spring brought off her master hail, but left behind her ain grey tail, the carlin clatter by the rump, and left poor Maggie scarce a stump. Now, wha this tale a truth shall read, Ilk man and mother's son, take heed, when e'er to drink you are inclined, 
or cutty sarks run in your mind. Think, ye may buy the joys or dear, remember Tam O'Shanter's mare. End of Tam O'Shanter.